Myanmar's army seized power in a coup that broke the country's fragile transition towards democracy. Moreover, state councillor Aung San Suu Kyi was imprisoned. Results of phase-free trials of Russia's Sputnik vaccine were published in the Lancet Medical Journal and showed that it is 91.6% effective against COVID-19. Amazon founder Jeff Bezos resigned as chief executive, with Andy Jazzy, chief executive of Amazon Web Services, stepping into the role of CEO. After underestimating the political influence of Navalny's 32-month imprisonment, Kremlin still finds difficulties in dealing with mass protests. According to OVD Infomonitor, 1,438 Navalny-supported protesters were arrested across the country only on Tuesday. For the first time in the Golden Globe's 77-year history, more than one woman has been nominated for Best Director in a single year. Regina King, Chloe Zhao and Emerald Fennell were shortlisted for the category. Marilyn Manson is facing abuse claims from actress Evan Rachel Wood, and at least three more women presented similar accusations. Loma Vista Recordings, Manson's record label, decided to drop the singer. Academy Award winner Christopher Plummer passed away at 91. The beloved star had an extensive career which spanned decades.